What is up my kaijus, it's your boy Zillazilla coming at you today with another episode of our Pokemon Ultra Moon Let's Play. Yeah, I'm trying to move up at the same time I'm talking. It's pretty dang difficult. And I just realized how big this neck hole is. Like, I fucking look... Oh my goodness. I, could, I look like I'm gonna like attack if somebody, if somebody gets so close. My, my shields are gonna go up. <laughs> Turn into a cannon and just start blowing things away. But, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys are having a good day. I know I am. I am ready to get back into this, especially since we got a trial on the way. I have updated our overlay. Look how nice it looks. Look how sweet it looks. Hopefully, it stays this way, and hopefully, we can kick some boot tay tay Our Pokemon are fully healed, but it's always okay to just check and make sure. Let's go, because the trial has started. This is what I said we were going to leave off. And here we go. Let's see if I remember this guy's voice. <clears throat> I am Kiawe. My Marowak and I are students of the ancient dances that have been passed down in Alola for generations. The trial of Kiawe. You will find that is a bit different than the trials you have faced to this point. But of course you will attempt it, right? Of course. Trial start. So ladies and gentlemen... My trial will test your powers of observation. There will be a dance, and then another. Your task will be to find the difference between the two. Begin! So here we go. I am really, really, really happy to be jumping right back into this, because it just... It's a lot of fun. I've been enjoying this a lot. Watch carefully and memorize this dance. So... Yeah, I'm just ha I just have a lot of fun. What's the difference from the previous dance? The middle. But but how? That was truly spectacular. And to add to the spectacle, come Marowak, Wawak. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just really excited to get back into this. I didn't even waste any time showing you guys exactly what I'll be doing. But but but. We got a long way to go, a journey to partake in, and let's switch out our mons so we don't lose anyone. That's the goal today. And I think Winona, our freshly evolved Winona, is the premier mon that we're going to be using. Even though we're definitely going to be using everybody, let me, let me tell you that first off. We're going to go ahead and bite, because I believe this is a ghost fire type now? That it is. So, yeah, I'm, like, well-equipped and well-prepared to take on this trial. This trial is probably, probably was the easiest out of all of them. Because of the type... You, you run into a bunch of Pokemon that, that run into the advantage portion of these against these Mons. Which is great for us. And our Lycanroc is freaking beefing up. And Roar? It's too late to learn Roar, man. It's too late. I just spit all over my computer. So I hope you guys are having a good day. I know I am. It is a beautiful, beautiful Sunday. And I am freaking hyped. I should have... I'm not going to learn Sing either. But I should have... Oh, I should have taught it Sing. Dang it. Dang it. That was a mistake. I should have looked at the music. Marowak was so pleased by your right answer that it simply had to battle you. Onward to the second dance. Why oh, is the hiker here? That's what I want to know. Watch carefully and memorize this dance. Uh. I don't know where they're looking. <laughs> I feel like the answer is. They have multiple answers here for these things. This is like a multiple choice test. Which one is the best one? Hiker David. David is going to find out today that he can't even keep a candle to me. So this is going to be... We're going to be using our starter to take this guy down. Which is good for us. Because we do have a, a huge, huge type advantage against a lot of these guys' mons today. And I am very happy to get through this without any issues the next trial is going to be a little bit more difficult for us so i'm hoping that noibat 
does most of the damage in that one, especially with its typing advantage. But you just never know, especially with... Oh, wow, really? Really? I thought that was going to kill. I knew I should use Bubble Beam instead. And we got hit by the burn. I can't believe we're burned, to tell the truth. But Aqua Jet should go ahead and take care of this thing. And... Like, I, I, the next trial should be hard. The next two trials should be pretty difficult for us. But I ain't going to say... Never never say die. There's a lot of trials on this place, and then I want to make sure I'm looking at all the mons that I do want to capture. So there is a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of stuff that needs to be done. I need to start doing some research on some mons. I got to start recording a new series thanks to Dragon Ball Fighter Fusions being over. Uh, if you guys want me to revisit that, let me know. Let me know, cause oh, whoops, what is going on? She just celebrating. She just he's he's just celebrating. Leo. I always forget that it's a it's a male mon. It should have been a female. My hiker friend was so pleased by your right answer that he simply had to battle you. Onward to the final dance. The <laughs> what is going on? The hiker's just twerking, everybody's just twerking together. So it's really fun. That's funny. I like it. These are outrageous. Yo, that's a big Marowak in the back. What was different from the previous dance? Yo, that's the totem mod? What? That was truly spectacular. And to add to the spectacle. Come, totem Pokemon. Waka, waka, walk. <laughs> waka, waka, waka. <laughs> It sounds like the Muppets. That's what, it, that's what the, the noise is derived from. That's really funny. I like it. I wish there was uh, a Lolan, a Lolan Cubone as well on top of all these mons here. Because it only makes sense to me. This Marowak is massive, bro. Holy crap. Alright, let's see what we could do. Let's see who we're going to send out. Let's see, let's see, let's see. We're going to send out with to get a heavy start for us. This gives us an opportunity to do some damage and, and be able to take anything that it summons to kill against us. Oh no, that's... That actually hurts. Ooh. That that hurt a lot more than I thought it was going to. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Salazzle, dang, you go in right away, huh? Alright, let's go ahead and hit them, hit them both pretty hard here. I hope Lycanroc's faster. I think Lycanroc's faster. There you go. I was hoping for it to hit both. But you can't get both... Both ways, you know? Poison gas. Uh, we should get... We should definitely look into getting Rock Slide. I think let Winona will learn Rock Slide. Unfortunately, Winona has passed on. It, 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 it just... It just wasn't meant to be. Let it be, let it be. Whisper words of wisdom. Let it be. <laughs> So here we go. Let's go ahead and Aqua Jet and get this Marowak off the field, hopefully. Cause I like the oh god dang it. You butt face. You are such a butt. You got me. Definitely got me. That did not do much that much damage. So that should give us an opportunity to at least at least, even if Leo does go down, we do have plenty of mods that can take care of the Salazzle. Even though Salazzle's pretty fast. Oh, wow. You butt face. It's okay. It's okay. Just... Uh, eat it. Oh, dead. Dang it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We, we, we made the, the right move there. Let's send out Izzy, see what Izzy can do. Uh, you just never know. So, Izzy might be able to do some damage. I hope it's fast enough, though. That's the main thing. I hope it's fast enough. I would believe it, Izzy might, should be, right? It's a flying type. It's a bat. Oh, you butt face. I should have known after every set, every move you would have used it. Venom Shock is going to hurt a little bit. Uh, it is the slowest mon on the field. That sucks. I hope I hope that the Salazzle use poison gas. That way we don't get hit too hard. Dang it! That sucks. I was hoping Izzy would do some damage, but dang, you just avoided all the damage. Flame wheel. 
Uh, so we're, we're, we're eating it a little bit more than I was expecting to, but it's okay. It's okay. It, it, it happens, you know? That's the whole point of, of fighting these battles, you know? And I think it's kind of interesting that Totemon... Ooh, yes! That's what I was looking for. The quick claw has popped. Pop, pop. If you know what that... If you know that joke is from, let me know, because that's it's a good joke. Leaf Blade, mmm. That is a good move to have right now, too. Even though it's both. Leafage, Razor Leaf is stronger, so we're going to go ahead and put Leaf Blade on instead. It's slightly stronger, but it, it it's okay. Torment, so we can't use the same move over, right? And then now let's go ahead and... Faint attack this thing. Let's see if we can actually beat this thing up. Because now it just becomes difficult. It really does become a little bit difficult. Ooh, that does a lot more damage than I thought it was going to. So sweet. Let's just hope. Oh, Venom Shock is going to hit harder, isn't it? Because of the poison. And we got the pop. There you go. Everything. Oh, oh that didn't do much damage. Oh, you made a mistake. Venom Shock would have hit us way harder. Venom Shock would have hit us way harder. Definitely. So let's see if this can take this Salazzle out. Wah! Dang it. Ooh! Ooh, that shows its love right there. Love me. Love me, my mons. Ha 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 ha. That's what I'm talking about. Zoroa, that's second that's Zoroa's second totem defeat, I think. Like, that's pretty good. Zoroa is not that bad. It just needs to learn some moves. That's the that's the main issue that I have. You know what I mean? Like, I wish it did learn some moves. I haven't had any need to use any of these other settings or tools here. Like, but that's what I'm talking about, though. The love came in clutch. That's what I'm talking about. I enjoy that. All right, here we go. Whoa. Spec. Spectacular. With your keen observations, you were able to see even fine differences in our dances, and you defeated the totem Pokemon with such ease. The totem Pokemon protected this Firium Z. Now it's yours. I have I have to put the Z crystals above me. I haven't done that, and I'm I'm sorry. That's my bad. That is my bad. So I'm going to make sure that gets done after this episode so we can move on. But I also got to go check on some chicken. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. But yeah, we have completed another trial. The trial is complete. But don't forget, ladies, to an ladies and gentlemen, to answer the question of the week. This is how you use the Z type, the fire type Z power. He was so amped. <sighs> Thank you, my dear Marowak. For even you met a Pokemon that would like to make your companion take these. Ten Quick Balls, that's not bad, that's sick. You opened up the item pockets and put them. What's more, you may now use the Pokemon ride Charizard. Charizard will lend you his strength and you will be able to go anywhere you have been in an instant. That's awesome. That is great for us too there. Ha ha ha. The Fireium Z. You should show it to the trial cap guide outside the captain's barricade at the top, at the bottom of the mountain. It is time for us to return to our dance. The feelings of the Alolan people, and our Pokemon, and the true Z nature of Z power. The answers lie in our dance, and so we must dance on. As he goes to dance, we have completed another trial. Ladies and gentlemen, we have moved up in this world. We have done what we have needed to do to complete the job. Let's see. If you cut right through the tunnel, let's go ahead down to the bottom of the mound. Ten. Let's see what's up. Let's see what's down. <laughs> but yeah. 
that was I always enjoyed that trial. That trial is fun and different from all the other ones, which is really cool and really really enjoyable. Like you don't really get to to do that all the time with with this with with the game because you're so stuck in in their trial trial stuff that you, you you're doing their gimmicks too much. And their gimmicks was fun and enjoyable and easy peasy lemon squeezy. We're gonna catch this Magby because I want it as a just in case, you know. It doesn't make sense to not have a Magby in your box. That's 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 a mon right there that you can add to the spot. A, like if if need be, you know. Oh, I should have used the quick ball. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna go ahead and you still use a quick ball, but you, you just never know. Fire spin is gonna be annoying to deal with, but it's all right. It happens. It happens. So, like, to tell you the honest truth, after this point is where it kind of gets I wouldn't say confusing after this point it's kind of where it becomes like a blur to me where I don't really remember exactly I like the fire that comes out I don't really remember exactly what happens after this I, I have a basic inkling but I really do, I, I spilled some water in front of me I thought I drooled but I have yeah as I said I have a basic inkling so I don't really really remember what happens after this, which I am very excited for, because that that gives it a different dynamic, and, and that also changes how the game is a little played now. I feel like the, the game is going to be, a, not, I wouldn't say safer, but I definitely am going to be playing the game the way I want to. I think it happened so fast after this point, I, I should have been released from Fire Spin already. Fire Spin takes me. Oh, see, there you go. Boom, done. Let's go ahead and throw this great ball at it. I do want Mag. I like Magby. I like the Mag Magby line. I like Mag Mortar. Mag Mortar does look kind of funky, like it doesn't fit. But it's a cool design. It looks very, very intimidating, which is awesome. Magby was caught. <laughs> oh, so close, so close, so close. So. Magby's data will be added to the Pokedex. Look at that Magmar. Look at that Magmar stance. I like that. I know what I'm naming this Magby. Why don't you check on what type of pal? Its body temperature is always around 1100 degrees Fahrenheit. If Magby falls into a small enough pond, the whole thing will dry up. <laughs> That's pretty funny. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna name this Magby. I hope you guys get where... Oh, no, not Purr. Pit. We're going to name him Pit for Fire Pit. You know? That, I think that's a cool name for Magby. I would like to, to have Magby. We're going to go ahead and send it to the box. And let's go. Magby might replace Flaffy, if I'm honest. I'm, if I'm going to be honest with you. Because we are... If once, once Jet gets to a high enough level, Jet should be taken care of of a lot of these water types that we're going to be going up against. So it would make sense to have Flaffy there, if you know what I mean. So we got we got to do some reevaluating. I need to go ahead and re-check out the routes. If this is female, I'm catching it. So just know that. <laughs> if it's female, I'm catching it cuz so I think Salazzle's cool. Nope, see. So we out. But yeah, no, that's... <laughs> really? I can't jump down that ledge? That's kind of ridiculous, but it's okay. Come on, show me female Salandit. Salandit the Bandit. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. I present to you the female. The female Salandit. Dang it. I got too big for my britches there, and I thought I can guess the future. <laughs> The future! <laughs> oh, man. So we're definitely going to save this... Oh, come on. There's going to be this cutscene. You! You passed Kiawe's trial. Good for you. So that means you can now ride on Charizard. In that case, why don't I tell you about a great way to play with Pokemon in your boxes? You ready for this? Press X to open the X menu... And then tap on Pokepelago to take off, okay? I'll be waiting for you and your Pokemon to visit. I like the, the country 
the country jive that I get. Ho, oh, that's some fiery MZ. Congratulations on clearing Kiawe's trial. In that case, and the tunnel has opened. We have created a portal to the next world. Captain Mattel's trial is up ahead. Go along Route 8 and you'll find it. Lush Jungle. So we're going to go ahead and save right here. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed today's episode of our Pokemon Ultra Moon Let's Play. If you did, please hit that like button down below. Come join the Kaiju Clan by hitting that subscribe button. And ladies and gentlemen, I hope you have a wonderful night. Peace!